Hello friends, this video on chemical bonding part 29 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching the video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 28. So, the molecular orbital, as I told, of a diatomic molecule, diatomic molecule we are, will be studying now, can we have sigma, pi and delta etc. But we will be focusing only on sigma and pi molecular orbital. Sigma, as I told, the name suggests is symmetrical, is cylindrically symmetrical around the axis, where the pi molecular orbitals are not symmetrical. Correct? See this example. So this is my two atoms, atom A, one and atom two. So in this case, uh, the sigma is possible for this, as I told. This is my s, this is my s orbital. There's a Possible of possibility of getting s molecular orbital from this atomic s atomic orbital. So this is my sigma, this is my sigma one s, this is sigma one s star because it is anti bonding. Also, if you see from p also, I can as I told right, I can have this uh, sigma because this p, p and p are head on and, and they have the same uh, molecular axis. Right? So we can have a uh, uh, sigma here, sigma 2p and sigma 2p star here, bonding and anti-bonding. Similarly, as I told, the other 2p, this one and this one, this 2p, they'll have a pi bonding, pi molecular orbital. So if you see this 2p, they combine to form pi bonding molecular orbital and pi anti-bonding molecular orbital. Correct. So let's see the energy level diagram for various uh, molecular orbital. So the exception here for oxygen, neon and fluorine, the energy diagram is this. And for other molecules, the energy diagram is this. So if we compare this, this is for my O2 and 2. So if you see the differences till from sigma s, sigma star s, sigma 2s, sigma star 2s is all the same. But the only difference is this. In case of oxygen, neon and fluorine, my sigma 2pz is lower than pi p. You can see that sigma 2p is lower than pi 2p. So if you see here also, my first sigma 2 becomes and then pi 2 becomes. But in case of other, my pi 2 p come first and then sigma 2 become. Rest other things are all same. If you notice the difference from here to here, 1s is all same. The only difference is in case of oxygen, neon and fluorine, my sigma 2p comes first and then pi 2p comes. Right? In other case, my uh, pi 2p come first and then sigma 2. Let's draw the electronic configuration for boron. So now if you see in this boron, we have boron molecules have 10 electrons, right? 5 into 2, it's 10 electrons. Correct. So this uh, theory says that uh, molecular orbital theory, you consider as a molecular orbital and just try to fill the electrons here. So 10, my 1s, so if you write the electronic configuration of boron, it is 1s2, 2s2, and then 2p1, right? This is the electronic configuration of boron atom, not from molecule. So 1s2, let, let me put two electrons here. And then 2s2, let me put this electron here, and 2p1, this electron. Correct? See, this is the order we had for uh, uh, boron. We have sigma, I think we have sigma 1s, sigma 1s star, and then we have sigma 2s, 2s star, like that. Similarly, here also we'll have this boron 2, so this guy also will have uh, same values, correct? Because this is b2, so boron this side, boron this side. So four electrons will have to fill here. Again, four electrons will have to fill here like this. 
now we have two electrons right so it will go first here and then first here obviously the same principle first uh, one electrons are filled and then only second electrons will be filled correct so the electronic configuration for this will be what so it will be if you see it will be a sigma 1 s 2 then we have sigma star 1 s 2 this guy then we will have sigma 2 s 2 this guy then we will have sigma star 2 s 2 then we will have pi 2 p you can say that 2p2 you can see that pi 2p2 correct one each or you can say that pi 2p x1 and then you can say pi 2p y1 both are same actually doesn't matter correct and now if you see uh, this has to be paramagnetic okay we will discuss that this is my electronic configuration. Let's take an example. Carbon. So carbon is uh, C two is C two molecule is two carbon atom. One carbon atom is atomic number is six. One s two, two s two, two p two. So let's put here one s two, two s two, and two p two. Similarly here also one s two, two s two and 2p let's fill it down we have four electrons here so let's put, fill the four electrons four electrons here let's fill the four electrons four electrons here let's fill it one two three and four correct that's how i will fill the lowest energy in this case so what would be the electronic configuration 1s2 sigma 1s2 Sigma star 1s2, sigma 2s2, sigma star 2s2, and then we have pi 2py2, and then pi 2px2. Right? That will be my electronic configuration. Pretty simple. So the only thing is you should know its order. You should know the, the diagram of this. And then this is pretty simple. You have one s, then you have antibonding one s, sigma two s, antibonding sigma two s, pi two p, sigma two p, and so on. Let's write the electronic configuration of nitrogen molecules. Nitrogen molecules are but two nitrogen atom, and electronic configuration of nitrogen is one s two, two s two, two p three. Correct. So let's draw this. We'll have one s two, two electrons here, two s two, two electrons here, two p three, three electrons here. So only here also we'll fill the same way. Two s two and two p three. Correct. Now let's fill it. Four electrons. Let's fill this up. Again four electrons. Two s sigma two s star. Now we have six electrons. First will go here. Second will go here. Third will go here, fourth will go here, fifth will go here, and sixth will go here. Correct. Now we can write the electronic configuration pretty easy. So this sigma 1s2, sigma star 1s2, this is done. Sigma 2s2, sigma 2s2, and then pi 2p y2. Pi 2p x2, and then we have sigma 2p z. Easy. Let's write the electronic configuration of oxygen. So for oxygen, we know the rule is different. So here uh, my sigma 2p comes first, and then pi 2p. You see, sigma comes before 2 pi. So we'll draw, we'll take this structure. So oxygen is molecules nothing but two oxygen atom. And oxygen electronic conviction is 1s2, 2s2, 2p4. So let's put electrons here. 1s, you have to put two electrons, 2s, two electron, and 2p4 electron. 1, 2, 3, 4. Similarly, here also let's put that 1s2 electron 
2s 2 electron and 2p 4 electron 1 2 3 and 4 let's form this 4 electron let's fill this 1 2 3 4 4 merge these two atomic orbital to form molecular orbital with 4 electron 4 fill 4 electrons now you have 8 electrons right from p so let's fill 8 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 and 8 correct so the electronic configuration will be sigma minus 2 sigma star minus 2 then sigma 2s2 sigma star 2s2 then we have sigma 2pz2 and then we have pi 2py2 pi 2px2 and then we have anti bonding right pi star 2py1 and then pi star 2px1 this is the electronic configuration i am just doing more example so that you can come you get comfortable with the electronic configuration once we know how to write electronic configuration will tell you how to uh, find the uh, different properties of molecule using the electronic configuration let's take the fluorine example fluorine also similar to oxygen here my uh, 2py comes before uh, sigma 2p right so fluorine also is atom is nothing but two fluorine molecules so one fluorine molecule atomic configuration will be 1s2 2s2 2p5 So let's put that one s two, two s two, two p five, one two three, four five. Here also one s two, two s two, two p five, one two three. Let's fill up four electrons. Very simple. Four electrons done. Now we have five plus five ten electrons. Let's fill it one two three four five six. Seven, eight, nine. This will be the electronic configuration of. Correct. If you want, you can write. Oh, that's okay. You can just write. Up. Let's take the example of neon. Neon also has the same <coughs> as oxygen. Two p comes before this one. Pi sigma two p comes before pi two p. So neon is nothing but two neon molecule, two neon atom. So for neon, the electronic configuration is one s two, two s two, two p six. So let's pull this one s two, two s two, two p six. One two three four five six. Here also one s two, two s two, two p six. One two three four five six. Merge it. Four electrons filled. Four electrons filled. Ten electrons. Five plus five. Sorry, twelve. Six plus six. Twelve electrons. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So all are filled. So you can just write the electronic configuration. Thank you. Visit examfear. com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials. Study from the best tutors and mentors, and much more. Thanks once again.